Hi, meteorologist Tony Petrocca in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. Yeah, five o'clock weather update we've been doing on the hour. And, you know, naturally when we're in the midst of the storm, the, the one thing that we use more than anything else is the, uh, what was the Doppler radar. So, uh, simple, the, the blue represents uh, snow and the darker strips of blue uh, indicating where the heavier snow is, is located. And we've noticed now that it started to shift into uh, southeastern Massachusetts. This little blip of green right here, which would indicate rain, more than likely that's a bad frame. Uh, it's really snowing just about everywhere with the exception of um, out of Nantucket. So the darker bands of blue, the heavier snow now starting to shift into um, uh, southeastern Massachusetts. Now, you see off to our west, some of the uh, lighter areas of, um, of blue, the lighter snow out in Connecticut, that'll be coming through are getting reports anywhere from, well, first of all, let me, uh, Michelle, um, who was traveling through, um, where was she traveling through? Uh, Barrington. She measured uh, 5.75, still coming down at a, at a pretty good clip. I get a report of 9.4 in North Smithfield, a 10 in Barville. Now, the 9 and the 10 is more the exception rather than the rule. Part of the northwest part of the state, a little bit higher, but it's been generally a statewide 4 to 8 inch snowfall. Uh, the numbers are still uh, coming in right now. Here's the wider view, and you can see that off to our west in western, western and central Connecticut, the snow is either stopped or it's really eased up. So that dry air is headed our way. That's the fortunate thing with this, this storm system is while it did snow fairly hard for several hours, and you know, it picked up anywhere from four, six, seven, eight inches of snow, it, it's a very progressive and it's a quick mover. Uh, in fact, case in point here in North Smith uh, Situate, Visibility is much better. They're, at one point, it was just coming down real hard here. Now, this is an intersection of 101 and 102, uh, which is snow covered. Uh, you want to kind of reduce your travel speeds here a little bit, unlike that truck that just went through. <laughs> but I'll go a little slower. Uh, not a lot of people on the roads now, and I'll give the, uh, the road crews some time to, to clean things up. Here in Providence, uh, I'd call it moderate snow. The visibility has improved a, a bit now. Uh, this is as of uh, 5, 10 p.m. And uh, the accumulations statewide, generally four to eight inches. I, let's say 80 to 90% of this has occurred already, but there's still a few more hours of accumulation, especially in southeastern Massachusetts. And again, while most of us have fallen within this four to eight inch range, a couple exceptions up in Boroughville and North Smithfield, uh, Boroughville at 10, John uh, reporting that, and, and I got a 9.5. Actually, no, I, I take that back. John, John reported 10 in Boroughville. So 10 in Boroughville and a 9.4 in, um, in North Smithfield, but uh, the rest of that four to eight. Take a look at the forecast now. We start at five o'clock, the bluish snow, and look how rapidly it pulls away. Here we are, 7.30, it's gone. Some Maybe a little bit of rain left over in the outer cape. Look at it, by eight, nine, 10 o'clock, skies are clearing out. This is 11 o'clock at night, it's clear or clearing, cold. Watch for slick roads, and overnight tonight's very quiet. That gives the road crews plenty of time to do all the cleanup that they have to do overnight and into early tomorrow morning. And here we are at 5 o'clock tomorrow morning, cold in the upper teens. So even though Monday's a dry day, I would more than likely think that, you know, some of these roads are still going to be slick, especially uh, some of the secondary run, uh, secondary roads. But with things being much quieter later tonight and overnight, gives the road crews plenty of time to uh, clean up. So as of 5 o'clock, wrapping things up, it's been a general 4 to 8-inch snowfall, a few areas of slightly higher amounts. The heaviest of the snow will be ending uh, by 6, 7 o'clock this evening, if not sooner. Last place for that to happen would be southeastern Mass, and then clearing out overnight, and then uh, dry weather coming up on, um, on Monday. Actually got a pretty active week. Another chance for snow on Tuesday. Another system by the end of the week. So, um, yeah, pretty busy. We'll keep you updated. In the meantime, uh, enjoy the big game. Kickoff is shortly. We have our crews out covering the storm, and of course, um, 12 News uh, will be on the air. Uh, on Fox uh, Providence at 10 o'clock and then uh, on CBS after the game. All right, that's the latest. Thanks for logging in. We'll talk to you soon.